So here we have Keith from uh, Qualcomm, uh, who's using like the Google Pixel phone, which is the new Qualcomm Snapdragon 821 process. Over to Keith, uh, what do you have to share about Qualcomm Snapdragon 821 on the new Pixel phone? Yes, we're uh, very pleased with Google's launch. Google's one of the first uh, manufacturers to use our 821 processor, which is our newest flagship. Uh, best power performance in the industry. So we're close with Google on a number of technologies. First, with respect to the camera. So Google uses a, 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 a face detect autofocus a dual. They use a, a, a 1.55 micron a large pixel a lens. So from a camera standpoint, they can let in a lot of light. The, the camera works great in low light. HDR plus is on by default. We work closely with Google. So they took a lot of the algorithms that used to be in the CPU and move it to our DSP with our vector extensions so you can get very excellent performance and visual quality at very low power. We also work closely with Google on audio. So from a noise cancellation standpoint, uh, enhanced voice services uh, on the modem. Uh, very quick uh, modem speeds. They have the best in class modem, 600 megabits per second download. So when Google provides uh, storage on the Pixel, uh, it can be done uh, seamlessly. And of course, we're very happy to work with the Google on Daydream. So you can take a Snapdragon 821 based handset, uh, starting with the Pixel, slide it into the, uh, to the dock that Google's uh, introduced today, and uh, have a great VR experience. So there's also a quick charge uh, on the device, right? Uh, uh, Google uses the, the uh, Type-C connector, uh, meeting uh, Type-C requirements uh, for their charging, yes.